Allegheny County Parks made a special announcement today. Two baby bison were just born at the South Park Game Preserve. You can see one of them right there. They're so cute. American bison are the largest land animals in the country, and a healthy herd has been thriving in the county for nearly a century. I got to see the new big babies up close today. Check them out. The bison herd at South Park Game Preserve welcomed two large bundles of joy. One baby bison was born Friday and the second arrived Sunday, both weighing about 65 pounds. Bison calves are known as red dogs. These red dogs are adorable and perfect and not camera shy. They walked over to us with their moms to say hello. When they're young, we just need to monitor them closely to make sure they stay healthy. They've had their vitamin shots and so forth from the vet. Uh, so. Uh, uh, so far, they seem to be healthy. They're milking, they're, they're running uh, with their mother, and things appear to be good. Allegheny County Parks Director Andrew Beckley says while the calves' sexes are unknown, the park staff did name them, Reese and Roddy. The one on Friday we named after Paul Reese. He was the first park director of the county uh, back in the 20s uh, when we, we were building parks when other people weren't building parks. You know, we were really ahead of our times, and Paul Reese was a world-renowned uh, park designer. And uh, it was his idea to have the, the North and South Park. The one born on Sunday, we really wanted to honor uh, Mr. Roddy, the first chief executive that just passed. But the group Friends of the South Park Buffalo Preserve, which helps spread awareness about the herd, announced on its Facebook page they chose Native American names for the new additions, Dakota and Elu, and they plan to stick with those names. It may be surprising, but these majestic animals have been roaming South Park since 1927 as part of the county's ongoing Buffalo Preservation Project. Many people call them buffalo, but they're technically American bison. It's always a big deal when calves are born here every spring. Education, I think, helps by knowing how important they are. Uh, but then we can continue to keep the breed going. You know, back when we got them in the 20s, there wasn't a lot of them. But, but they've really come back some since. The herd has nine adults, two males and seven females, one of which may still be pregnant. That means a third baby bison could be on the way. This is your public park. We're open every day of the year, free of charge. Uh, come and see the, come to the game, game preserve and uh, check out our new bison. If you want to see these big guys and the new babies in person, you can visit dawn to dusk any day of the week. I suggest you do because they're awesome to see there. There are public feedings on Tuesday, Tuesdays and Fridays at 930 a.m.